All right, hello everybody. This is the bus driver, and I'm here to take you to school. We're back with some more NHL 16. Be a GM here in the off season of of season two. We just lost out in the playoffs in the third round to the Chicago Blackhawks, which is not very fun, but you know it happens. Um, and then we saw the Hawks are playing. Who are they playing in the final? The Lightning? Yes, looks like it's the Lightning. Okay. So let's head here to the giraffe then. We'll see who wins the cup as well while we're at it. <clears throat> then we'll see if our team grows. I have had some lineup change advice from you guys, so we'll see if we implement that in the new season. Manitoba Moose win it. Interesting. Let's see. What do we have left to scout? 3-3-2. Three, three, let's check these goalies out as well. Perfect. Get the last of our goalies in there. <clears throat> and hopefully, we will pick up someone good here in the draft. I can't remember if we traded our draft pick. We'll have to take a look. Uh, let's see the awards from this last year. So, Stanley Cup went to the Tampa Bay Lightning. Stamkos and uh, Drew in and all them. The Oilers won the President's Trophy. The Blackhawks won there, and yeah, we knew that. Okay, next is the Player Awards. Tyler Sagan won the Art Ross. Stamkos won the Hart. McDonough won the J Norris. Patrick Kane <laughs> won the Lady Bing. Um, Nikolai Ellers won the Calder. Okay. <clears throat> um, ben Bishop won the Con Smythe. Jonathan Quick won the Vesna. Jenning went to Anderson. Frederick Anderson. Bill Masterson went to Kalo. Never heard of him. Anyways. Selkie went to Jonathan Taves, of course. <clears throat> Ted Lindsay went to Stamkos. And the Rocket Richard one went to Ovechkin, which is no surprise either. Let's see if anyone in the AHL won anything useful. The Moose... There's our Ice Hogs. Yeah, Rockford's last, right? Yeah, they must be. Yeah, it's Rockford, okay. And then let's see, any player awards from our team? <clears throat> oh no, we're the San Antonio Rampage. What am I talking about? Jeez. Anyway, so we had Katanasi won the uh, Sullenberg, which is the most points, interesting. Goomple won two awards. Interesting. We're just scouting. You know, there's some rookies out here we might want to look into. Ray Emery won the goalie one. Interesting. All right. Well, <clears throat> that does it for that part. So let's take a look here at our team needs real quick. Um, maybe we'll start with our rosters first. Oops, that's not what I want. Actually, maybe we'll check our trading block. Oh, we can't. Never mind. Can't adjust our trading block yet. Do we check progress reports? Well, now's a good time as any anyways. I'm pretty sure we did. Lindholm way up there. Interesting. Sorella is up. Brad Stewart's going down. Holy shit. He needs to go. Westland. Alright, let's see who's in the system. Bitten went up. And... Goulier, uh, Gauthier, sorry, Goulier, Gauthier, jeez. <clears throat> um, and do we have anyone that really looks like they're going to be playing next year from the minors? Zadarov, yeah, we know. Bork, Troy Bork, should probably come up. All right, good to know. All right, well, let's go ahead and... We'll just go straight to our budget. Why not? Or not budget, our uh, trade deadline. We'll do our trading block. We'll go the day before first. Rampage had a really good season. Jeez. There we go. That's what I want to do. Edit our trading block. So we're not going to give up our firsts. Not yet. We're still a young team. McKinnon. Holy crap. Look at that. We have Voracek too. We picked up. Last off season, just looking at these, man, our team should be doing so good. We did make it to the third round, so we're not terrible. 
So I definitely have some faith in our guys. Ugh, excuse me. Let's see. Grigorenko. I thought he was an elite. Maybe not. Um, Carl Soderberg. We can consider getting rid of. Who else? Oh, Eric Johnson's getting up there. How many years does he have? Four years left? Alright, we'll keep him. We will keep him for a couple more years for sure. Alright, alright, alright. Um, let's take a look here. The lock. I thought he was supposed to turn into something good. We could trade Tangay. I'd prefer if he retired here. Holden's getting old. Let's get her Holden. And then Brad Stewart, if we can find Brad Stewart. That's just go straight to our defenseman. Where are you, Brad Stewart? Oh, did Brad Stewart retire? Huh. Unless I can't read. Which is equally possible. Maybe he retired. Huh, interesting. Brad Stewart retired. Martin and Picard. Ooh. Oh, well, Picard's growing great. He's going to be our backup. Martin's getting pretty good, too. Um, who are we going to put out there, then, on our... Let's take a look by age. There we go. Dan Carcillo, he could probably go. Cody McLeod could go. Let's put Dan Carcillo out there. Nah, he's a fighter. McLeod's been here forever, though. Maybe we don't want to get rid of him. Uh, let's get rid of Dan Carcillo. Grinder or two-way? Oh, they're both grinders. All right, well, you know what? McLeod, he's been here for a while, so he gets to stay. We want... We definitely want first sec and seconds. Why not? You always want first and seconds. Never turn down a first or... Well, you know, to some extent. Yeah, and we'll trade off all these. Okay. Perfect. Here we go into the draft. Let's see who we can pick up. New Jersey's up first, followed by the Blue Jackets, Panthers, Canucks. Go, oh, Canucks got two in the top five. Huh, they are going to be tricky. Flames are at 14. We're all the way up here at 25. So, um, let's take a quick look here. Is there anyone we want to pick up? <clears throat> Maybe we want to pin them. Let's see. Mm, any of these names ring a bell? Chara? That'd be fun to pick up a Chara. Okay, you know what? None of these names really ring any bells here. Let's see if there's any goalies. We do have two pretty good goalies, so I'm not too worried. Ah, uh, Skinner's a goalie. Okay. Alright, well, you know what? Let's just go to our pick. Gertson and Carcillo for a th two thirds and not even this year. Oh no, this year's and next year's. Not. Wait, okay, let's see what. How good's Gertson? Is he an up and comer? He's got a seventh D. Let's see, Gertson, Gertson. Gertson. Okay. He's got a little bit of potential behind him. He's a 74 overall. Fourth round. High 7th D, that's not terrible. And he's 22. I think we got to give the kid a chance. I don't think he's worth a third. Or, I don't think it's worth only a third for him. <clears throat> Hold in for a second and third. Huh. We will we'll consider this offer. There's no turning them down yet. Let's see. Hold in. Hold in. He is 30 overall. Went undrafted. He had... Ooh, he didn't do good for us at all last year, did he? Ah, oh, 17 points, okay. And a plus 3. Ah, right, not terrible. Must have been his uh, 
playoff stats. Let's see. If we were to get rid of him, how would our defense line up? Let's see. So we've got Tyson Berry over there at 89 overall. Ooh, maybe he's going to break 90. That'd be great. One, two, three, four, five. We would need to call up a rookie. Are we ready? Maybe it's Bigris' turn. Maybe we call up Bigris and see what he can do. He is 22. You know what? I think we, I think we make this move. We're moving up to a second for Holden. That's not terrible. All right. Yeah, let's take this. Perfect. Gertzen and Carcilla for a second. That's not terrible, but no thank you. We already looked at that. Gertzen should stick around. No, we will not trade down right now. No, Bitten, I think, is a rookie we want to keep. Are we moving up? Uh, yeah. Uh, is Carcilla worth moving up? He might be. Let's see. Where is our position? Our second 17 is... Okay, so that's our worst second. And then we're going to pick up... decent second all right sure let's let's take it we need to dump carcillo we don't really need him anymore um ooh, a first next year i do like sorella though i don't know if i want to give him up sorella and bitten um, we might as well check bitten while we're here i think i don't think we want to pull the trigger on this one look at our elites holy jeez I have seen Sorella grow to an elite potential. I don't know if he will for us, though. He's only a top six right now. Where's Bitten? Ooh, and he's bottom six. Seventh rounder. All right, so he might not have much behind him. Which is okay. Question is, do we think we can pick someone up better than Sorella? Which... I wouldn't put it past us. He doesn't have high potential. He's 20, though. There's plenty of room to grow. Uh, first next year. We can get rid of Sorella. Let's get rid of Sorella. Let's... I don't mind giving up Bitten. Let's, let's see if we can make this fly. That looks pretty even to me. You know what? I bet you we can get away even without Edmonton second. Let's go with our seventh this year. All right, let's see. Are you guys up for that one? All right, no thank you. Okay, so let's put our third or our second back in there. I don't mind. A first is better than a couple seconds. And next year, who knows how well Otto is going to do. All right, let's see. There you go. Two seconds and bitten for a first, which is great. They really want Sorella. We will not be giving him up, though. Mistel, I don't want to give up either. He can grow. No, thank you. Oh, man. Sometimes I regret this, but there are some good trades out there. No trade gets rejected right away. He put a little thought into it. I do think Medvinov will grow as well. No seconds. Give me some firsts here, guys. First, first, start talking. There we are. Okay, I'm going to take a quick look, see who went first overall. I didn't catch it. I don't know if you guys did. Let's see where some of these guys are. Blake, a top two -way. All right. An elite playmaker over there. Interesting. Kravenchko. And a starter and Skinner. Okay. All right, so there's one gem. Ooh, Patrick's an elite and Kuliman's an elite. Okay. Defenseman, power forward, center. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. 
just double checking, making sure there's no other gems that might have come by here. Doesn't look like it. Wrath G. Oh, I've heard of Wrath G. All right, let's make our pick. Let us see. We don't really need a goalie. Well, here's the last first. A defenseman is not terrible. I don't mind. Let's go ahead and pick up Belfour. Ooh. If only he was good as Ed. That's who we'll take. All right. Sim options. Sim to our next pick in the second round here. Oh, never mind. We have a... Holy shit. All right. Well, I didn't know we had two sets. Oh, that must have been Ottawa's one. Okay. Interesting. So that wasn't terrible then. That decision. I'm not paying proper attention. My mistake. Unless we had two, two firsts to begin with, and I'm just losing it here, which is equally possible. Okay, I think we're going to stick with forwards here. We just picked up a defenseman. We could use some snipers. We could use some playmakers. So we got a sniper here in Commodore. Just power forward. I'm a big fan of power forwards. Let's see. We didn't even scout this guy, so that doesn't help. How did we scout this guy? Did we even? Yes. Ooh, okay. He's got some good senses out there for... Uh... All right. You know, I think we're going to go with the sniper here. Noah Commodore. Oh, yeah, yeah, my mic definitely did die. So we're going to go with the sniper here. Nick Commodore. Or Noah Commodore, sorry. Sorry, Noah. So to our next pick here. And we should be up there. Ooh, no thank you. We should be... The next one of ours is in the second round. Not really interested in these seconds and thirds. I think Sorella has a chance to grow and and everyone else so far. None of these are really enticing me here. Okay, here we are. Pick 19. Alright, let's see. We might just end up picking based on name at this point, just because we can. <clears throat> um... Two-way defender, two-way defender, two-way defender, sniper. And there's a playmaking center. We do have a lot of centers, though, and a playmaker left wing. We don't have... We need someone to be the next Tange. So I don't mind picking up Oliver Strom. Sturm. How do we do that? Alright, so that's all of our picks. So we're going to sim the entire draft. There we go. Bell, four, Commodore, Sturm, and oh, there, we did have one more pick, which was McDonald. My mistake, but, you know, after that point, I wasn't really looking for anyone specific, so. That's great. So, I think I'm going to stop it. Ah, you know what? Let's do some re-signing first. We can definitely get some re-signing done here in the next couple minutes. At least get our first day of it done. Alright, so let's take a look based on overalls who are expiring. We're good on Duchenne, McKinnon, and Landy, which is great. Grigorenko we need to sign. We definitely will. Hmm, let's see. He wants... Ooh, he might grow. He wants seven and a half in eight years. Alright, let's, let's give him... Uh, let's give him two. Let's we'll give him a two year. Up till no three year. Up till he's twenty six. Yeah, I like that. Okay. So we can give him three point six easily. Let's do that. Three point six for the next four years. Vincor is gonna. All right, he grew to an eighty two, but he's not gonna grow anymore. So that's not great. Zadorov will resign. Ooh, Zadarov might not grow. 
That hurts. I'll give him a four-way deal, bring him up to 26, and that's when we decide. We'll give you a... <coughs> uh, yeah, we'll give you a uh, 2.6 mil dealer. Belfour, there's a top 4D, that's great to see. We will definitely give you an offer. Bork. 80 overall, okay, alright. I think, he, oh, we already knew he was an 80 overall, didn't we? Alright, well, let's see, is he going to grow? Oh, he wants a one-way, so. Or two-way, so we'll give you a three-year. There you go, perfect. Three-year, two-way contract. We might sign Smith. Bottom six. Ah, oh, maybe. Catanassi, he, oh. Man, Catanassi lit it up. We gotta reward him for that one. We'll give you a two year. See if you can grow for us. Hishton's getting old. Oh, there's Sturm, our second overall pick, wasn't he? Or was he our third? Or second round. All right, we'll give you an offer, as well as Noah Commodore. Got to give these guys a chance to grow. Corbett's 23. We'll definitely probably go for him. Siemens, ooh, 23 and an 81. He can step in, take over Malak's spot. I like that. That doesn't look like he's going to grow right now, but maybe, maybe, just maybe. Okay, we'll give you a two-year deal. Bring it to two-year 25. Agazino is 26, not great. Freddie Hamilton, who is the brother of Dougie Hamilton. Uh, it doesn't look like he's going to grow. We'll see. Rankin, uh, don't know. McDonald, that's our other rookie. Maybe we'll decide. Oleg. Just looking here. These guys, you start running out of... All right, so yeah, not much work to be there. Let's take, take a quick look at our goalies. No one we need to sign, which is great. The card's only an 84 overall. He's got one more year to grow. So hopefully he will. Otherwise, Martin's our guy, Spencer Martin. So let me take a quick look here. Yeah, we're definitely just about up in time for this episode so <coughs> I'm gonna quickly do our morale here oops that's not the morale don't know what I've been smoking let's quickly check this Eric Johnson he doesn't like that we traded him well you know what suck it up buttercup you're not happy Dan Carcillo went well you know shit happens Mikhail Grigorenko. All right, perfect. So that is all that. I am going to take a quick break. So for those of you watching on YouTube, thanks a lot. Take a look in the description below for my information. YouTube.com slash bus driver, twitch.tv slash bus underscore driver, and at bus driver on Twitter. All those spelt with an L3 US. Hit those like buttons, hit those follow buttons so you can see when I'm live. Join me in chat. I love talking with you guys. So the only way that can happen is if you talk back. Um... I'd love to talk about it, the game. We can grow this team in real time, make changes in real time, which would be great. Um, other than that, if you're watching on Twitch, stick around. I'm going to take a quick, quick break here, and then I'll be back to finish up and go to this signing stage after we're done all this. So thanks a lot, and I'll see you then. Take care.